Praise the Lord. Glorious and wonderful is our omnipotent sovereign God who has blessed us with another day, beloved brothers and sisters, to rejoice and be glad in Him for what, who He is and what He has done for us in our lives and what He's going to continue doing for those that stay steadfast in Him. Amen. Those that truly believe and stay steadfast in the Lord of hosts, God Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth, who, who, who lives and reigns and is seated at the right hand of the Father, beloved brothers and sisters. Amen. Pleading our cause for uh, us to inherit the kingdom of God. Today is the day that the Lord has made and we will rejoice and we will be glad in it. Amen. Praise God. Giving Him glory, honor Him and thanks to Him and blessing Him on His holy Sabbath day. Amen. The, the day that He has ordained to enter into His rest. A, a, a day that He has sent, beloved brothers and sisters, and He has set it and made it a sign for his children, for his people. Amen. Praise God so that they, they will know who, who he'll know who, who his children is. Amen. All those that heed his voice and his commandments and obey what he has said and what he has written in our hearts. Amen. We give glory, honor, thanks, and praise each and every day, beloved brothers and sisters, as we all enter this day. We're going to sit here and read some gospel. We're going to sit here and praise God. You know, tomorrow, this is the weekend that is uh, uh, the Pentecostal weekend. This is the week, beloved brothers and sisters, that the Lord sit here and the Holy Spirit came down and inflamed all, my, all our brothers and sisters, the true disciples of the Lord, when they were up in the room praising and worshiping God and, and giving Him glory, praying to Him, amen. And, and he gave them to them. He gave them to them what he asked, what would they asked, and, and it was the fire of the Holy Spirit, amen, that, and it was for obeying, for obeying, for seeking him with all their hearts and all their minds and all their souls and all their being, being as we are doing this day, amen, those that are called to his purpose, those that are called by him to be justified by him, to be glorified and to be sanctified by the word of truth. Amen. Praise God. And that's what we need a whole lot of. There's a whole lot of truth that needs to come out in these days, beloved brothers and sisters. There's a whole lot of truth that needs to be spoken unto all you hearers that are out. All you that have an ear to hear, amen. Especially you that are professing the Christ. Professing my master Christ Jesus, Joshua HaMashiach, who is blessed forever, amen. And is seated at the right hand of the Father. We're going to sit here and we're going to pray. We're going to praise. We're going to worship the living God for who he is, amen. For he is worthy, and he alone is worthy of all our doings and all our beings, beloved brothers and sisters. And we're going to ask the Lord of hosts, God Almighty, to sit here and manifest himself with us, in us, in our hearts, and in our minds, and in our souls, beloved brothers and sisters. So that way, we can be found in perfect peace, those that are seeking him steadfast, in our hearts, and in our souls, and in our minds. Amen. Praise be to God. Let us pray unto the Lord, God Almighty. As we sit here, we open up this holy, sanctified Sabbath day that is a day that the Lord has made and ordained for us to worship, to glorify Him, to honor Him for all that He is, all He's doing, and all He's going to do for us. Amen. In a time to come, beloved brothers and sisters. Heavenly Father, glorious and wonderful are you to have blessed us another opportunity to sit here and gather together, Father God, the gathering of the saints, no matter if it's through this device, Father God, or if it's one-on-one -on -one in person, for you say in your word, where there are two or more are gathered in your name, Holy Father, that you are there, that you are there, that you are sanctifying, that you are washing, that you are cleansing with your word and purifying yourself a holy people, Father God, a people unto yourself. Amen. And we thank you so much for counting us worthy enough, Holy Father, to sit here and handpick us to sit here and come to you boldly, Father God, in our hearts, in the throne even more of our hearts, Father God. For we know, Lord of hosts, that you dwell in a tabernacle that is not made of man's hands. You don't dwell in anything that's made by man's hands. You dwell on things that are made by your hand, Father God, and that is our our. Our bodies, your temple, your holy temple, Holy Father. We love you, we glorify you, we magnify you for who you are, Holy Father. As we sit here, we gather, we're going to sit here, pray, praise, and worship you, Lord, Holy Father, and ask you to, to 
Open up the windows of heaven, Holy Father, and, and bless us with your Holy Spirit. Bless us with your presence, Holy Father, as we sit here to gather into the saints to sit here and praise and worship you, Holy Father. For you tell us in your word that abundance of peace uh, of God belongs to those who love your instructions. Nothing can make them stumble. And, it's keeping, and in keeping in your truth and instruction, you tell us, and the peace of God which surpasses all understanding will guard our hearts and our minds. For we stay steadfast and focused on you, Father God. Bless all my brothers and my sisters that, that are on this reservation. Those that, are, that are, are, are out there. All my brothers and my sisters. For all your children, Father God, from one nation to the other. From one end of the world or four, all the four corners, Father God. We're asking you, Father God, to you for you to light, light your way for us. For you to sit here and... and let your peace and, and, and your Holy Spirit convict us and, and carry us to where we need you, Father God. Keeping us steadfast. Work with us, Father God, on things that we need to overcome. Bring it to mind. Bring it to our attention, the things that we need to depart from so that we can be found with our hands clean, our hearts pure, and, and our garments white as snow as you have made them for us, Holy Father. Not deceivingly, but in spirit and in truth. By faith and believe in you, Holy Father, I know that you are working. In my Master Christ Jesus, Yahshua HaMashiach's mighty name we pray. Amen. Praise be to God. Amen. Each and every day we praise that Psalms. And Psalms tells us to enter his courts with praise, beloved brothers and sisters, and a heart full of thanksgiving for who he is. Amen. For above him there is no one. Beside him there is no one. Underneath him there is no one, beloved brothers and sisters. Amen. I like to praise God. I like to give Him glory for who He is. Amen. So let's praise it up. And let call God, the Holy Spirit, light, children of light, children of our omnipotent sovereign God. There is an endless song echoes in my soul. I hear the music ring And though the storms may come I am holding on To the rock we cling How can I keep from singing your praise? How can I ever stay? How amazing is your love How can I keep from shouting your name I know I am loved by the King And it makes my heart want to sing I will lift my eyes on the door 